<laughs> you, why you don't like using the blankie, girl? And I will come and little chair. I can be you whatever I wanna be. Today, breastfeeding battery. I just wanted to show off my baby's reusable diaper. Uh, they're actually good for two peas or one poop. And I mean, they're just so freaking adorable. This one has unicorns and rainbows. Uh, what else did I want to tell you? Suddenly, my milk just, the supply just, like, bombasted. It just got really, really big. The only thing that I've changed is, um, taking a bit of estrogen and also getting 200 mg of caffeine. Um, I drink those little Starbucks iced lattes now. Uh, I, I split one bottle up into two. Um, and I just drink it throughout the day. And so I drank it last night at like 6 a.m., which is really early morning, you know, twilight time. Um, I drank it when she breastfed, and I was able to stay up while I feed her, which means that she got, like, a better feeding in comparison to me trying to sleep and lay on my side and her having to access me while the both of us are trying to lay down. I'm trying to go back to sleep. Um, so, yeah, that helped a lot. And uh, I just felt way more refreshed and awake, you know, so... I also got to pray during that time at 6 a.m. It was pretty nice. Um, so what else? Um, uh, I mean, I don't know. I really like the reusable diapers. I think that they can help prevent diaper rash. I, I find it easier whenever a baby poops to use a small washcloth and water and soap in comparison to using baby wipes, especially because those baby wipes, was leaving lint on my baby, and it was pretty hard to get the lint off of her. Uh, especially, like, if you wanted to use them for a sour neck, the lint kept getting stuck to her. Um, but whenever I just use a wash rag and soap, I mean, it's, everything's perfect. And she has her own wash rags, and it's pretty freaking quick, you know? Uh, but I'm using a reusable diaper so that all those little baby folds can get some air. Because I've noticed that with the other diapers, you know, with the, like, paper diapers, you don't have to change them as fast. Uh, so they sit in the wetness a little bit longer, and I know that they have, like, drying mechanisms, but, like, those little, the elastics on the side of the diapers sometimes leave lines on her, and I'm like, uh, you know, it wasn't my favorite. So now we're using these reusable ones, and, you know, I've noticed that her poop does have a whole lot of color in it, so I'm going to give my grandma a phone call to figure out um, if her poop so yellow because I like to eat cheese a lot. Um, and then I was thinking today about how serious I take my diet while I'm breastfeeding. Because, uh, you know, yesterday we were talking about me taking my weight loss vitamin, but how I can't take it yet. And how I just started taking my estrogen, but I only take it now that she's three months old. And my sister was like, girl... You can do anything. It's fine. I know people who do the worst of things in breastfeed. I'm like, well, I didn't do it because I didn't care. I did this because I care. So I like to really look into stuff before I just go doing it, you know, for my child. So, so yeah. And my goal is to start weaning on October 19th. But I may have to go all the way and breastfeed her for one full year just because, um... Just because I don't want to rush myself into trying to lose weight. And I don't want her to have formula. And uh, I heard she can't drink real milk until she's one. But I wanted her to get the almond milk. But I heard that they, need, that they can only have cow's milk by one. And I don't think almond milk comes from cows. That's why they call it almond milk. But I still need to talk to her doctor about it. Um, but other than that, she's just been very, very happy. Uh, once I started taking the estrogen, my milk turned, like, snow white. You know, before that, my milk was, like, the little see-through white. Your milk can be a whole, whole, whole lot of colors. I've never really had yellow milk with this baby. Uh, I did get that yellow colostrum with the, with my other three in the beginning. But now, I mean, it's just snow white, and it is here. And I finally got the pump. I put some more milk inside the freezer, and hopefully she does not eat it, because we're planning a trip soon. And 
I just don't want her to drink that milk. Like, if I have to put a safety lock on that milk, honey, I will. If I got to put do not eat on that milk, I will. But, you know, she gets whatever she wants, and I have the supply for her. It's just every time I store it, it's like she magically knows that she wants to drink all of it. So you see her propping her arm up while she eats. That's her favorite move. It really is. So now I'm just really waiting for her to let go. I'm also supposed to be ordering pizza. Um, I took a break from my diet uh, over the weekend. And, um, I mean, I'll get back on it soon. But it'll be after I eat a little bit more pizza and a little bit more hot wings. I did manage to do a 100 sit-ups yesterday. That she then finally gave me the energy and the motivation that I needed to work out. Day one, I was like, I was like, cool, you know. It helped me with like those racing thoughts. It helped me with like anxiety and stuff. Um, it helped me not pick small arguments with my husband. Because uh, all those things can happen when your hormones are low after you have a baby. And then on day two, I felt more of an urge to kind of work out. Um... We had the most wonderful, intimate moment. That was great. And then day three, I was finally able to work out. So here we are on day four, and I feel great. I do want to hurry up and do those two ups while I can, but, of course, she's eating. I also slept better. Let me tell you, I slept beautiful, wonderful sleep. And she started taking a little bit longer naps. So I was happy about that. But anytime I do something and it makes my children sleep more, it scares the hell out of me. <laughs> it really does. But at the same time, it makes me pretty freaking happy. Um, so I've been looking at my body progress photos, and I do see my belly going down. Uh, I just haven't been doing them as much, so I really wouldn't know, really. Uh, but I did notice that my leggings were bigger today. So, I am Tsunami, and this has been our breastfeeding diaries. Uh, reusable diapers, don't be afraid of them. Grab you some. And it's better for the environment. Oh, yeah.